in the voice. You're dead. Welcome back, Alex. You're dead. You're like your voice actor is dead. Oh my no. god. Oh my god, that's such a good Mountain Dew. Oh, fucking blow it when I drink the Mountain Dew. Yeah, you've got to, if you recall, welcome back, Alex. Welcome back. Um, oh, if you recall, God. you've got to get this barrel up that thing. Yes, I do recall this. I can do it for you. <laughs> do you want me to do it for you? No. <laughs> no, this is your odyssey that you're going to have to yes. undertake here. This is my odyssey. So, yeah, no, there's the barrel down there, and then you got to put it in the suction thingy, and then there's these flames you got to shoot Ding. buttons underneath to turn them off. And then there's more flaming jets inside the air tunnels that you got to take them through. It's just a giant clusterfuck. So you're going to want to hotkey your fireball. Yeah. Fireball! Fire! Fire! Look at this fucking cat right now. Oh, she's being a cat. She's laying in a very... There's something there. There's something there. Oh, yeah, right now. This is the kind of commitment we have to this game for you and you only, Alex. Because you're the only one that watches this show, apparently. Oh! I hit the wrong button. You can get him to stay on that. Command him to stay, and then you can get into a better position to shoot the thing. Oh, great. My mom messaged me almost an hour ago and said that the thing is on AMC. Awesome. Okay. It's a good movie. It is a good movie. But which one is it? It's not the thing 2011, is it? Better not be. Not a good movie. It's an average movie. Damn it. <clears throat> Just too late. Shut up, dude. <laughs> I'm too late to apologize. <laughs> Extra careful. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, you're gonna see that steam <laughs> thing in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's playing a game all at once. Well, I changed it so that way it actually signs me in when I have it pulled up. Oh, good. Because for some reason I like always I had to manually sign in. Which was yeah, every time we try to play something, <laughs> you're like, Taylor, you're offline. I'm like, what the fuck? No, I'm not. Um, I've been I've been seeing some some people playing Deadlock. Have you played that? No, I haven't. No, okay. I haven't either. Like I got uh, like in on it. Like I I have access to it. I haven't downloaded it, but I haven't played it. And I don't probably I probably won't. Yeah, I, I don't I, think it's my kind of game. Like the, those are not my games. The only the only thing that had me intrigued was that it's it's a Val game. Do you want me to save state you here? Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry. What save state? Uh. Oh, oh God. I'm gonna um, make sure that I don't accidentally overwrite it this time. Uh, save state to selected slot. There. There you go. Nice. Uh -huh. Hopefully that works. Should we test that it can load first? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Sorry to. <laughs> this is just a quick, you know. That's today's date. Oh, yeah. Nice. All right. All right. All right, so every step you make forward, we're going to do that. Every step you take. I think that's funny. I've, I've, I'd be lying if I... I've been playing some emulators recently. Fuck. I've been playing... <laughs> I've, been, you. I've been playing some emulators lately, and I've done the same thing, actually. Yeah. Now, you know, I only got so much time in my life, Taylor. I, well, yeah, I mean, we all do. But I mean, like, <clears throat> what game was I fucking playing? I was doing some other game recently... Ratchet and Clank. And it was really fucking annoying. No, I think it might have been Beyond Good and Evil or something. No, come back. I've been playing that a little bit come here and there. You stay right there. What other games have I been playing? I've been playing a couple oh, of different no. emulator games. I don't know. Go. <laughs> Trying to rotate the camera. Come on, Billy. This yeah, is not. This did not have analog control. All right, we're going to save that one. Okay. All right. <laughs> save state to selected slot. There we go. We're good. Yeah, upon playing Beyond Good and Evil again, it's basically Star Fox Adventures, but just different. I don't know if I would say it's better or worse. It's 
It's. It, it, I would say, like broadly speaking, I think the world is more interesting. But like the thing about it is that like, um, there are like still some like really antiquated design things in it from like the time period. Like just like really like poor and stupid like backtracking in certain spots and things like that. All right, let me, let me get you going here. Save state to selected slot. There we go. This is the one you, I think you lost it on the last time we played this game, like a year ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> B and Billy, uh, this is the the last time we're going to be probably recording anything like this in this apartment. Oh my god, what the, the fuck? fuck? <laughs> what the fuck happened? <laughs> <laughs> That's how it fucks me. Alright, load it up. Yep. Well, that's unbelievable. Like a bitch ass game. Cheap like it didn't even like yeah, it like deliberately went out of its way to fuck you on that. <laughs> go. No, oh, you're good. You're good. You can go around it. That's not bad. That's not that bad. It's like some kind of weird physics thing. Alright, here we go. Yep. It's like um, I must have had it squeezed between it, so it didn't yeah. know where to go. And it's See? just like, hey, we're gonna shoot out. Yeah. So I think you gotta blow up that there. You almost killed yourself. Great. Yeah, it's just one. <laughs> you don't need those. <laughs> it's like mid burp. I'm telling you, you don't need that. You don't need that either. Oh, Dad. Um, I think you have to do it again. Truthfully, I think you have to do it again. Oh, maybe not. Oh, you gotta command him to flame that thing and then it'll cut the... Oh, there you go. Yeah, get him lined up and then you gotta command Tricky to flame it. Fucking animation takes longer than I was thinking. Yeah. I mean, you could just have it going back and forth, and then it shoots it, probably. Oh yeah, you too. But you gotta, you gotta like, if you're gonna try to center it up, so do the stick. I think you can. You probably can command it from here. I don't think I can. So I'm just gonna get it lined up as much as I can. Yeah, you're going too late, bud. Dude, I'm fucking working on it. Okay? You literally see me. The world does not revolve around you. Okay. Uh, yeah, you gotta go sooner than that. Like, right... Now. Oh, no, too early now. Bitch! Hold on. This is a really poor mechanism. Whoever designed this is fucking... Stupid. Right now! I don't know. A little later than that. Yeah. No, 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 no. There you go. Got it. There it is. My ankle. <laughs> My fucking ankle. We got. God, that's so stupid. We did it. That's a very ah. flammable <laughs> rope. A very flammable rope. No. I don't even know Crystal. How does he know Crystal? He doesn't even know her name. <laughs> it's true. I'm sorry, what? Did he say sharp cores? It sounded like it, yeah. Ride me! <laughs> this is another turret section, I think. Did your voice change? It sounded like it, yeah. I think the guy was doing um, like his voice, yeah, like and they're like, "Hey, we need another line. Can you do this?" Oh, man, I don't even. Remember. You know, the pickup. Yeah, the pickup lines for him getting rescued were like done. You know, what, Billy, can you pause? Save it manually. I'm gonna save state you here because I think this air. I think this thing is stupid, and I would hate for you to fail it, and for us to have to do it all again. Save state to select a slot. There we go. Okay, there we go. So you gotta shoot all those down. We're, and I think we're we gotta shoot some towers or something. Oh, everybody's playing. Who's playing what? Planet Crafter. 
Oh, that's a good game. Oh, is it? Yeah. I think I saw that one. You gotta shoot that big red, this ISR on at the top there. The big, oh, big, yeah. big girl who fucked me button. Yeah, you gotta shoot that. So you gotta protect this stupid guy by shooting these, whatever these are, and you gotta shoot down the towers. You're just fucking letting him eat hits. That's... You have to shoot these, like, you're not going to get him on the first go around, so you have to protect him. <laughs> I hope nobody's motion sick. <laughs> I've never, you know, like, I know, Billy, you and I discussed it. You let me borrow uh, your VR shit to play uh, Half Life Alex. Uh -huh. I've never been motion sick before in gaming <laughs> until I played that game. Yep. At least, like, with the continuous movement. Like, it fucking, like, made me sick. <laughs> like, yeah, VR, <laughs> VR is a whole different beast. Because once you actually get your mind tricked into being in the world, yeah. that's when it fucks you. Oh, yeah, I bet. And then any, any movement that is not your own, that it's, like, really, like... Like, uh... <clears throat> when you accidentally hit the back, going backwards when you didn't mean to. Right. Well, Melissa did that to me. She was... I was in a spot where there's, like, head crabs, and then she comes up and starts touching me. I'm like, no! Not now. <laughs> Don't do it! Not while there's a crab around. Because <laughs> then you're the head crab. Yeah, I, I, I really did enjoy the, uh, like, different experience of, of playing that game in VR, because it's like... Um... Well, we'll see where it starts. It'll probably start you back up at the beginning of this. It's fucking better. Yeah. Okay. okay. That's okay. That's fine. Oh, but you gotta watch the stupid cutscene every time. Ugh. Okay. Next time. If yeah. I, if, if you I have fail to build again. Well, at first you're thinking you can just tank this shit, but you yeah. can't really. Yeah. No, no, it's. I see how it is. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, the the tactile kind of thing of, of VR, like actually having to like point a gun and shit, was really cool. I thought it was really fun. I think it would have been interesting with like a different controller because I feel like the Vive oh, yeah. controller is maybe a little limited compared to some other ones. But yeah, like it was still pretty it's cool. It's definitely it was made to have the uh, uh, the uh, uh, what oh you call God. it uh, the Steam. Uh, the valve index. Oh yeah, because yeah, yeah. it okay. actually would allow you to like finger individual, individual fingers. Yeah, yeah, because otherwise it's this. I think it's just like the digits and then the thumb. I think. Yeah. Right? Yeah. No, it was either either way. It was still cool. So like I don't know. Maybe one day I'm glad I at least bought Half Life Alex because if I wanted to play it again down the line, if I bought my own VR headset, that I could do that. Yeah, and then you could play with something more. A little bit different. Yeah. More tuned to actually. Yeah. Playing it, for the game because yeah, the game was, you know, made for the the Steam Deck or Steam Deck. The, well, that uh, would make sense. Yeah, if Valve developed it. Yeah. Now, sick game though, really good. I highly recommend you finishing it when you can because it's. And uh, yeah, now that I got it again, it's I, really. I cool. cleaned up uh, the area where I was using it. Yeah. So that I could re-plug it all back in. Yeah, you gotta, if only, like I said, the reason I wanted to play it was because I went through a big Half-Life spree recently, and I, would, I played through all the games again, <laughs> just in light of, like, Half-Life 3, like, potentially actually being a thing at some point soon, and I'm like, oh, I gotta catch up on the lore, and I haven't played Half-Life Alex, so I wanted to see what it added to the story, and I'll tell you, I'll tell you, I'm not gonna spoil anything, obviously, but literally the ending of the game is the only thing it adds to oh, the story, okay. and it maybe adds, like, all said and done, it only maybe adds, like, a minute of extra stuff to the actual story from, from the cliffhanger that we've been hang, hanging on since 2007. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's why I, I would really hope that Half-Life 3 is going to actually happen this time. Well, from what I understand, or what the leaks have said anyway, is that, like, they've had multiple versions of it in existence, and they've, like, shit-canned all of them. Yeah, because it probably doesn't make up for... Well, they, I think the way that Valve uh, looks at it anyway is that, um, is that there's, like, uh, Half-Life has always been kind of linked with, like, a jump in technology. Yeah. So they want to, I think, do the same thing with Half-Life 3, if at all possible, so... I think the rumor mill suggests that they're doing like 
not an open world, but maybe like semi open world type stuff, maybe like a Metro Exodus or something. Which I would like. Which I would like also. And then, I need to beat that too. And then they're doing um, procedurally generated areas within that world, I guess. So like, you know, you could replay the game and then like a certain section of the of the game would be completely different every time you play it. Which would be sick. Which would be really cool. Yeah. And then the other thing I think that I've heard them talking about is like, remember, uh, they compare it to Mario Galaxy where you're like on like a little planet and then you jump and like the oh, okay. gravity so, of the yeah. planet holds you, you know? So it's something like that. If you f- fucking miss this. Oh my oh. god, Billy, are you shitting me? You're not going to make it, bro. Should I just reload you? No. <laughs> you're going to do it? I'm going to attempt to do it. Okay. All right. <laughs> Say if you miss this, you're fucked. <laughs> Oh my no, god. Okay, reload. Hurry, hurry, Taylor! Before I have to listen to him again. This is because I want powers. There you go. Okay. <gasps> if you fail this time, I'm going to do it. I'll do it for you. But yeah, that's those are the big three things that I've heard about uh, Half Life 3 is procedural generation, semi open world, uh, and then gravity shit like from Mario Galaxy. Okay. So and gonna, allegedly, allegedly. They're gonna do maybe a whole smorgasbord of things. Well, it sounds like they're gonna like implement Zen back into the game because Zen was not in Half Life Two in any capacity. No. Right? So it's like you know they I think um, are gonna make you go back to Zen in some way. I actually looked up some fucking lore, also. Um, uh, there was some shit going down about... Well, MatPat had a video out a while ago. He, th- he said that fucking... Uh, what's his nuts? G-Man is a Nihilanth. But I think there's been some more convincing evidence uh, within, I think... Um, I don't know if it came from Half-Life Alex or if it was just in the lore of Half-Life 2. But they call the uh, the, 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 the monitors Shaulathoi. Mm-hmm. Have you heard about this? Uh, you know about I know... Roughly, I don't, I don't know it off. Well, it says something along the lines of like the Shulathoi, the Shulathoi can like choose their their form before they like hatch or some shit. So I just saw a lore video and the guys are like, G-Man's a fucking Shulathoi. Like he could pick his fucking shape, so he did that. He made himself a man, made which would exp- a man. Which, which would explain his irregular speech patterns and shit like that is that he's a fucking alien man. I mean, obviously he's an alien man. Yeah, clearly. But, like, you know, the advisors have, like, the fucking, like, telekinetic abilities and shit like that. And obviously, like, G-Man has the ability to teleport and stuff. So, like, that took a lot of health away from me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what, the like, what the fuck? It was only supposed... I'm like, oh, it's just two, so it's gonna take two little ticks. So everybody, everybody thinks, or at least I, I'm kind of of the camp that, uh, I think... G-Man's a Shulathoi. So he's like a form of advisor, basically. Okay. Which I think makes sense. You'd have to actually watch the lore video. That's, there's much, like, kind of like some more compelling evidence for that. But, um... Oh, it was in a series of fucking tweets or something. Like, one of the writers, like, tweeted out a bunch of shit. Um... But he was doing it under the guise of like his account was like uh, compromised, like, like or no, it was like a ca- like a character from Half Life making oh, a post okay. or something. I forget. But anyway, it's cool. It's cool. Uh, so he's a uh, Lithoy. All right, Billy. I think you got the one left now. Yeah, just the one. I think you're in good shape. And I got more than half health, so I can tank all these hits. No, no, you can't. So, yeah, there's, like, this data miner guy on, on YouTube I watch named uh, Tyler McVicker. Tyler McVicker? And he, uh, I think it's this one, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's, this it's the same one as before. Yeah. It's because it, it, this one doesn't... Because the angle is yeah. shitty. Because it's a shitty angle. Just trying to take it. Oh, you yeah. did it! There we go. Like, fuck it. Oh! <laughs> Tank the shots oh. and it. <clears throat> It's your mother, Fox! <laughs> terrible creature! <laughs> Queen Earthworker, you're gonna have to fuck her in the submission. <laughs> I've already been doing that all game. All right, first chance you get, pause the game because we're gonna save it and I'm gonna give you. Oh, this one's stupid, boss. I think I remember this one. It's another turret section because they were running out of ideas in this part yeah, of the game. So everything's turrets. Everything's a turret section. 
Yeah, it's like a giant flying dragon guy or something. Flying dragon bat. It looks like a Digimon. Yeah. I got a mod for that TCG game where it's all the all the cards in the game are Digimon cards. Oh yeah. You can also get a uh, what you call it. Uh, you uh, not Yu-Gi-Oh, but um. Pause it. Pause it. Pause it. Pause it. Save. Why are you hammering shit, Debbie? What are you doing? Hammer and shit. Clearly. Save state. Two selected. So. <laughs> right, I know we're cheesing this fucking part of the game, but it's annoying. This is an annoying section. I need a little bit more length. Uh, what was I saying? Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Oh, uh, Pokemon card. You oh, can make yeah. them Pokemon cards. Oh, dude, they didn't give you fucking full health before this shit? You gotta shoot the button to stop the jet. Otherwise, you take one ticket damage. Are you serious? Why would they not fill you up on health before you did this fight? Yeah, I know. Is there no way to get more health? <sighs> we might have fucked ourselves on this, dude. Oh my god. Who thought of this? Do you have to shoot those? Doesn't seem like it. Then what was the point? Oh my god, dude. Oh, he gave you one tick back. Are you serious? Oh my god. Yeah, we might have fucked ourselves on this. If you die, I'm curious if they give you, like, full health then, hopefully. I hope they do. They probably don't, because they're stupid. Is there like an auto fire we can do? <laughs> <laughs> you would have to set up a, uh, a what you call it, like a macro or something. Yeah, a macro to make it so I can just constantly fire. There might be a setting. I'm like in between episodes. If this goes, but like to the next one, I might look at that because that would make this a lot easier. Can you, if you hold it, does it just no. stop shooting? Yeah, just stop shooting. Oh, there was oh a yeah, thing I saw there. that. Shit. Ugh. Still did damage. I'll be invisible for that one. It wouldn't be so bad if like the aiming controls weren't so shitty. Like yeah. you have to hold it in place to aim, which is annoying. At least the tactic is easy. Just shoot the fuck out of him. <laughs> like. Like, you, there's not, like, a pattern you gotta go through. You just gotta make sure you don't fucking take any more damage. Yeah. Oh, oh I it. saw it. They hide those really well, don't they? There's one. Yeah! Cancel out the damage you just took. God. I've... I forgot about this part till then. Oh my god. Oh Are you my. shitting me? Oh. This is gonna be like some Dark Souls shit where you get him right to the end and then you're gonna die. You're just gonna fucking. In your effort to get it, then you're gonna get hit by these blue things. Give it to me, <laughs> motherfucker. They need to make it so the fucking uh, silver, those silver rings give you more than just one tick. Yeah. Like, that's not enough. Oh, nicely done. And it canceled out that damage you just took. Whatever. You're getting them. If you do, the, if you do this first try, I'm going to be so fucking pumped. Oh my god. It's just so much clicking. <laughs> You might have, you might, he's going for it. <laughs> oh, come on. Splash bullshit. That's good. That's good shit right there. Billy, I think if you can at least, like, not take any damage, you might have a shot. Oh, oh. God damn. Dude, that's so fast. Yeah, it's really fucking fast. How is that fair? I couldn't aim low enough to fucking hit it. Oh, man. 
Oh man, is it there? No, that's a flame jet. Sorry. Just get him, dude. Just fucking. Should I save state you here? No. <laughs> no, that would be a poor idea. Well, there it is. Oh, uh, I got two. Oh, you got three. three. Oh, oh. Get out, get come out. on, come on. No, give it to me. Get yes, out. yes. You gotta, like, gotta get closer to him. Like, wait to get closer to him. Shoot the thing. I didn't even see it in the fucking... I did. I did. Oh, dude, you might have him here. You might have him here. Lead him. Lead him. Oh, dude, you're so fucking close. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. No. <laughs> this is fucking get it, get it. You're you're dead. No. Oh, my finger. <laughs> so close. Oh, oh, ba -ba -ba dance. Oh, oh. Do you just keep going? I hope that I Yes! Yes, okay, we're fine. <laughs> yes! Thank God for all those Bafama dads. I didn't know if the Bafama dads were gonna make like, me fucking restart. Okay. Well, that was that was there was no need for all that tension then. Okay, are you dead? <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> but I completely deflate the whole thing. <laughs> well, it's a good thing I didn't save state you because I would have been like, oh shit, now we got to redo the whole fucking thing. Yeah. God, yeah. There should be a fucking auto. Like, god damn, my thumb. Ugh. I'm not like I was when I was a kid, and I could just fucking Ugh. constantly shoot lasers out of my arm. Oh. Push, oh, him right push him right into push him right into the fucking lava. Fuck your life. Who's that? Hey, who are you talking about? Yeah. You talking about the like the big rock guy? That did not match the fucking what he said. That subtitle. No, it did not. Okay. Now you gonna waste your time going to Dinosaur Planet again? Yeah. Should we end it here or anything? Yeah. Uh, Twenty nine minutes. Uh, next time on Chin Church. Uh, nah, that was it. <laughs> <laughs>